Apple has always been at the forefront of innovation, and with the new iPhone 14 Pro and Pro Max, they've outdone themselves again. The new Dynamic Island feature is a game changer for how we use our phones. In this video, I'm going to show you all about the new Dynamic Island update, which only exists on the iPhone 14 Pro and Pro Max series, but not the regular iPhone 14 and 14 Plus. This is a cool feature that a lot of people have been waiting for, so if you're curious about what's new, then stay tuned. Before I reveal this exciting information, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and press the bell icon to stay tuned to our latest videos. With that said, let's get started. How about we start with a quick overview of what Dynamic Island actually is. In a nutshell, the Dynamic Island is a new way to get information at a glance on your iPhone 14 Pro or iPhone 14 Pro Max. It uses the pill-shaped notch to give users more information. However, it's not just an aesthetic change. The Dynamic Island is also functional and it makes some pretty significant changes to the way people will use their iPhone 14s. Well, you might be wondering why Apple decided to go with this design. And there are a few reasons, but the most likely one is that they wanted to fix the notch. The notch has always been a bit of an eyesore, and it's something that a lot of people have complained about. With the Dynamic Island, Apple has effectively put the notch on an island, which makes it a lot less noticeable. Another reason for the change could be that Apple wanted to make the iPhone 14 Pros more functional. As I mentioned before, the Dynamic Island allows you to do things like view your music playback and get directions from maps. This is a huge change from the way that the iPhone has been used in the past, and it makes the iPhone 14 Pros a lot more useful. The last reason I want to talk about is that Apple may have wanted to make the iPhone 14 Pros more future-proof. With the Dynamic Island, they've effectively created a space for new features and updates. For example, we could see the Dynamic Island growing in the future to include more shortcuts and indicators. Or, Apple could use it to introduce new features that we haven't even thought of yet. So, it's possible that the Dynamic Island is just the first step in a long line of innovation for the iPhone. You must have guessed by now that the Dynamic Island is pretty cool, but you're probably wondering how it actually works. Like the name suggests, the Dynamic Island is dynamic, which means that it can change its shape and size. Apple demonstrated this at the launch event that the notch may grow into a multitasking shortcut. It may display music playing, directions from maps, audio being recorded, ongoing calls, and much more. If you hold down on any of these indicators for a while, they will grow into a small window where you can interact with more of the UI. There may be several apps shown on Dynamic Island at once. While the app you most recently used will be front and center, you may access more options in Dynamic Island at any time. When you play a video, Dynamic Island returns to its normal layout, with no additional icons. Nothing occurs if you touch on it. Overall, the system works effectively, and Apple has developed an API so that developers may use Dynamic Island as well, so you can customize the features on the Dynamic Island. The way you interact with Dynamic Island will be mostly the same as the way you use your phone today. Don't worry, these gestures are pretty intuitive, and you'll get the hang of them in no time. And it seems like the possibilities are endless for what Apple can do with this new feature. Public Reaction Since Dynamic Island was first announced, people have had a lot to say about it. Apple enthusiasts took to the social media platform to share their thoughts, and the reactions were mostly positive. People think that Dynamic Island is a great idea, and they're excited to see what Apple does with it in the future. Twitter users shared their excitement, claiming it was a good reason to purchase the iPhone 14. Okay, this Dynamic Island looks so smooth. That alone might be a good reason to get an iPhone 14 Pro. And of course, the internet being the internet, there have already been a few memes about Dynamic Island. One user shared a hilarious post saying that, guys will be like, I know a place and then it's just Dynamic Island. So, there you have it. Everything you need to know about the Dynamic Island on the new iPhone 14 Pro and Pro Max. From its sleek design to its many functions, the Dynamic Island is sure to change the way you use your iPhone. What do you think about this new feature? Do you think it's a game changer? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe, and click the bell icon to be notified of new informative videos.